well with that stuff, and I was going to ask this. I said, you want to call it Langdon Post Studios? And I said, no. It's been Don Post Studios from the beginning. Let's go with the name of the fault. People know that. And uh, well, otherwise, we'd people be, like you. Otherwise, we'd be talking about Langdon Post Studios. That's right. So um, that's what we did, and I had free reign. And in short order, found out that, that it wasn't done. It had sculpted a lot of the math, but Pat Newman had. Don had sculpted others, I mean, back, way back in, in the day when he did Mussolini and Hitler and, and uh, Besky and all of those characters, and he did some of the other characters, too. Was, was Hitler a big seller? <laughs> yeah, there was a huge seller. Really? Because <laughs> people would buy it, stick it on a dummy, and burn oh, it in oh, yeah. And the same with, uh, with Mussolini and with Stalin. Wow. And he did those masks called The Dictator, and Marshall Field probably got real rich on those masks, because that, that was one of Marshall Field's biggest sellers. Yeah. And, uh, and there's, there's some of that art still survived. Uh, Junior has it, and uh, Dan Roebucker collector has some of the ads with those masks. Yeah. Um, so Don was the, the originator of commercial over-the-head masks. But he got the idea from a circus clown in England who was doing Popeye. And Don saw the 